I'm coming your way from the police depot here at Tesano, Accra, where the IGP, uh, John Kudalo, is about inspecting um, his men to know if indeed they are well prepared for the 2016 general election. So you'll be witnessing a number of simulation exercises uh, on managing violence and related issues. So come along as I take you through um, these exercises. ongoing now uh, in relation to managing violence during elections so as you can see a group of individuals protesting in relation to the election then you have a number of uh, police officials trying to manage the situation but the demonstrators are forcefully you know trying to have their way so the contingent of police you are seeing are trying to manage this is a simulation exercise I must actually um, state but they are unable to manage the situation effectively so the regional commander has asked for reinforcement so what you are seeing is you know right control officers coming in to assess the situation so you can see real-time violence so so now it is becoming very violent and as such you can see some of the police officials calling in the police so Having no. tried to manage the situation, and it uh, like that. it's actually then, having uh, worked. If it is out of yeah. like the they are trying to manage it so well. The most powerful that the most robust, so we call it the common fight. How things will be managed come November or in December or even after the elections. Please now let's move over to see how hostage taking um, situation should that happen could also be managed by the Ghana police service. As you can see there are a number of police officials going to rescue the people who have actually uh, been taken hostage in the room. Coming your way from Accra depot here in Tesano where the IGP Inspector General of Police is inspecting preparedness of the Ghana Police Service to counter terrorism and all that. So uh, you can see uh, the terrorists and the uh, hostage takers in there. So the officials are now entering. And this is actually a simulation exercise ongoing as we speak. So an official has been able to overwhelm or outpower one of the terrorists. This is to tell you how prepared the uh, police officials are to manage terrorism activities. And if you come to this side, you can see them in the room. You'll be able to see much of the action as it is actually happening. So they are right there in the room. So they'll be coming out from time to time. So as you can rightly see, these are uh, the two men were actually taken hostage and they were expecting families and relatives to come and pay ransoms so the operation is over and the hostages have been rescued it went successfully uh, well it was successful so they are retreating and then taking them away so this is to tell you how prepared the police are to manage terrorism activities as and when they happen just um, next to me you can see the IGP and then director of uh, CID watching on as these activities unfold. We as a police service are prepared to contain any violence that uh, occurs during the elections because there are some violences or some crimes which are unpredictable but when it's all over the world. We're here in America in a gay edition, gay, uh, what do they call it, uh, it's a pub, about 49 of uh, 50 people were killed. They could not predict it. 
So some of the violences we cannot, we cannot predict, but what happens after it? That's what we are going about now, trying to bring everybody on board. The chiefs, the youth, the parties, ourselves, all Ghanaians to be law abiding. As we always say, policing is a shared responsibility. We cannot do it alone. How much how we tried and how long our arms are, cannot reach everywhere. But as an institution, I assure you that whatever this violence okay, we shall do everything which is a policeman likely possible to nip it or curb it as it occurs. I assure you that we shall live with a very secure society and environment after the elections. So it's been a thrilling journey. It's been a very interesting and I want to believe you um, learnt a lot from it or had a fair idea of how prepared the uh, police um, is towards um, 2016 general elections. From time to time, we shall interact with them and see how best um, the election could be well managed from their perspective to ensure that things go well for us all. Gabriel Obodai Togbashon reporting.